Hey everybody, welcome to my video about Recover It by Wondershare. In this video, I'm going to review this great data recovery app and show you how to use it. So stay tuned. Recover It Data Recovery is a great data recovery app that will help you undelete or rescue your deleted files, photos, videos, audio files, emails, and more. Recover It Data Recovery can restore everything back to you from your PC or Mac, including external hard drives, USB flash drives, and SD cards. I'll be reviewing the Mac version of the software specifically in this video, but the interface for both the Windows and Mac versions of the app are almost the same, so even if you're a Windows user, this video may be helpful. First thing is to download and install the app. I'll leave a link in the description below. Just download from the Wondershare website and run the installer. It's really user friendly. When you first launch the app, it will likely ask you for your password. This is normal as it needs to be able to scan your whole computer. Once you've launched Recover It, you'll notice that it has a really simple user interface, making it easy to use. The basic principle of how the software works is that it scans your desired location, shows you the results, and gives you the opportunity to recover the files it finds. When using Recover It to undelete or recover a file you've already emptied from your Mac's trash can, you have the option to search by device, external device, or even location. In my example, I'm trying to recover an RTF file called TestDoc. It was saved to an external hard drive in a folder called TestJan2020. So I'm going to search by location and select the folder TestJan2020, and then click Next. Now it's going to scan the drive and folder to look for any files it can recover. This may take some time depending upon how large the drive is. If you're using a notebook such as a MacBook Pro, I'd recommend plugging it into the power as this can be a processor intensive task which will use up your battery faster than normal. Once the scan is completed, you can either explore the results to find your file or run a search in the search box in the upper right. You can also search through the results using the sidebar and specify whether you want to explore by file path or file type. Once you've located the desired file, click the box in the upper right corner of the file icon and click recover. Then it will prompt you to choose the location to save the recovered file. In this example, I'm choosing the desktop to make it easy to find, but you can choose whatever is best for you. Once you've chosen the recovery location, click save. Then recover it will recover the file and a confirmation window will pop up at the end letting you know it's completed. Now if you go to the recovery location, you'll see the file. In this example, it created a folder on my desktop containing the recovered RTF file. Recover It also offers a pretty cool video repair solution that repairs videos in different formats like MOVE, MP4s, MKVs, AVIs, and more. It repairs videos that got corrupt while shooting, recording, transferring, editing, converting, or even processing. It's a great solution for those who work with video files often. Recover It is a simple user-friendly data recovery program for both Mac and Windows. Next time you need to undelete or recover a file, check it out. I'll leave the download link in the description below so you can check it out. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And while you're down there, don't forget to ring that bell and subscribe to the channel for more tech videos, including tech how-tos, every week. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.